everybody i hope you're having an awesome day welcome back before we get started don't forget to hit the like button i wanted to talk about the movie that i just went to go see yesterday i watched the new detective pikachu movie and i thought it was so cute i even painted a picture i drew it right after i watched the movie and then i painted it for you guys so i'm gonna put that video somewhere over here maybe <laughs> i wanted to let you know my thoughts on the movie. I thought it was really cute. The character designs were amazing. I wish that there was some scientist out there that could like, I don't know, make some kind of Pikachu hybrid monster thing. <laughs> I want a Pikachu. <laughs> That's terrible. Is it terrible though? I mean, I think most dogs that we have now are like monstrosities. They were all bred from wolves and now we have like pugs and chihuahuas like I'm sure they can make a Pikachu that's what I want I want a Pikachu I need a Pikachu like right right here a little Pikachu he would be adorable right there so I actually played the detective Pikachu game before I knew there was a movie coming out I liked the game I couldn't really follow the storyline in the game but it was fun to play and really easy to get through. I loved Pikachu's voice in the game and when I found out they were casting Ryle, Ryle, Ryan Reynolds as Pikachu because it's not what his voice sounded like in the game. He had this kind of dark almost detective noir type voice and my foot's itchy. Ryan Reynolds doesn't really have that voice. I kind of get it now because he's like friendly and open and he can be marketed better towards kids, but I kind of wanted someone like, I don't know, Joey Diaz. <laughs> Is that bad? Is that bad that I wanted Joey Diaz to be Detective Pikachu? <laughs> anyway, the movie was super cute. I kind of wish that they had given maybe even more screen time to some of the Pokemon. Like, the way they hyped it up in the trailer, I was expecting to see more of them. But you do see a lot of them. I just kind of wish there was more screen time with them. The other part that I really enjoyed about the movie was Pikachu's addiction to coffee. I could totally relate to that. I am also addicted to coffee. I guess that kind of explains why I drew Pikachu drinking some coffee. The sketches for him, he was like, <laughs> obsessing over the coffee and I kind of toned it down a little bit. He still looks like a anime girl kind of loving on some coffee. Mmm, coffee daddy, right? So I thought the movie was super adorable and if you haven't seen it you totally should go see it. Even if you're not a huge Pokemon fan, the amount of work that they put into this is crazy. Like, I can't believe how real they look and they just kind of integrated seamlessly into each other the pokemon and then the people and the surroundings everything looked so cool i've always been a really big pokemon fan like as far back as i can remember the what like the 90s or something i love pokemon i actually have a massive pokemon card collection i don't know what i'm gonna do with all of them i guess i'm gonna pass them down to my kid who also has a lot of Pokemon cards. <laughs> we just feed each other's addiction to these things, but they're so cute. <laughs> anyway, I want to hear your thoughts. Did you see Detective Pikachu? Are you planning on seeing Detective Pikachu? Do you like Pokemon? Do you really not care? I know some people don't like Pokemon and I don't know why. They're super cute. I mean, how can you not think that this is adorable? He is so cute. He just wants coffee. <laughs> Anyway, if you like this video and you want to help support the channel, please hit the like button or share it out with your friend. And if you're new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and join my little awesome channel. But with all that being said, I'm Ganna. Thank you for watching. And as always, safe travels, good luck, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!